And a Moberly man remains in the hospital tonight after a chase through town ends in wreckage this morning. His status and his name still haven't been released, but police say the 24-year-old tried to drive away from a traffic stop. He didn't make it far, though, before coming to a violent stop in one sleepy neighborhood. ABC 17's Joe McLean now with what neighbors say was a rude awakening. Moberly's police chased a 24-year-old man in a Chevy Cobalt just before 1 this morning. It all started here at the 900 block of Quicks Road and ended here in the Fox Run subdivision when the man lost control of his vehicle and crashed into an Ameren utility pole. We heard um, high-speed uh, sirens coming up the road really quick. Yeah, I mean, you could tell they were really moving. And then all of a sudden we heard a loud crash. Just a big boom and like maybe some pieces or something hit our house. When residents opened their windows, this is what they saw. The man's vehicle wrapped around one of the poles that supplies power to their homes. One by one, the houses went dark. We lost power, but, um, we noticed it just went out instantly. I heard the crash, and then it was about three seconds later, we lost power. Police tell us the man sustained non-life-threatening injuries and was immediately taken to University Hospital. Ameren was able to restore power to the subdivision about seven hours later. In Moberly, Joe McLean, ABC 17 News. And another chase overnight, this one in Fulton after a gas station break-in.